Deep within the forest floor, a silent terror reigns. It is a world teeming with life yet fraught with danger. Here the balance of power is delicate, and the slightest disturbance can spell doom for the unwary. An army marches, millions strong, each soldier driven by an insatiable hunger. They move with purpose, a well-oiled machine of destruction. Their mission is simple, to find food and bring it back to the colony. But their methods are anything but simple. These are not mammals nor reptiles but creatures far smaller far more ruthless. They are the foot soldiers of the insect world executing their tasks with precision and efficiency. Their small size belies their immense power and ferocity. These are ants, the apex predators of the insect world. Their strength lies in their numbers and their unwavering determination. They are relentless, stopping at nothing to achieve their goals. Imagine the world from the perspective of a grasshopper, innocently nibbling on a leaf. Unaware of the impending danger, it goes about its day, blissfully ignorant of the terror lurking just beneath the surface. The ground vibrates. A single ant appears, mandibles like scimitars, eyes cold and black. It is a scout, the first wave of an impending invasion. Its presence signals the beginning of the end for the unsuspecting grasshopper. Then another and another a tide of chitin and rage. The grasshopper's world is turned upside down as it is overwhelmed by the sheer number of attackers. There is no escape, no mercy. This is the reality for countless insects. They live in constant fear of the ant's relentless assault. For them, survival is a daily struggle, a battle against an enemy that never rests. For them, the ant is not a nuisance, but a nightmare made real. It is a force of nature, an unstoppable juggernaut that leaves destruction in its wake. The ant's presence is a constant reminder of the fragility of life in the undergrowth. This essay will delve into the terrifying world of ants, exploring their brutal hunting strategies and the visceral horror they inflict upon their prey. We will uncover the secrets of their success, the tactics they employ, and the sheer brutality of their existence. Prepare yourself, for what you are about to read is not for the faint of heart. The world of ants is a dark and dangerous place where only the strongest survive. It is a world of terror, a world of death, a world where the ant reigns supreme. Ants are masters of coordinated assault. They operate as a single terrifying entity, a swarm intelligence capable of overwhelming prey many times their size. Picture this, a lone beetle, lumbering through the undergrowth, unaware of the danger lurking beneath foot. Suddenly the ground erupts. Dozens of ants, jaws agape, surge from the earth, latching onto the beetle's legs, its antennae, its struggling body. The beetle thrashes, desperate to break free, but the ants hold fast, their grip tightening with each futile struggle. This is the terror of the ant swarm. There is no escape, no mercy, only the cold, calculating efficiency of a predator bringing down its prey. The ant's primary weapons are its mandibles, two serrated blades that can snap shut with incredible force. These are not mere jaws but tools of destruction, capable of dismembering prey with surgical precision. Imagine the searing pain as those jaws clamp down shearing through flesh and chitin. The ant's bite injects venom, a potent cocktail of neurotoxins that paralyze and subdue the victim. The prey, still alive, can only lie helpless as the ants swarm over its body, their mandibles working tirelessly to tear it apart. This is a slow and agonizing death, a macabre feast where the victim is consumed alive, piece by agonizing piece. But the ant's arsenal extends beyond its physical weaponry. Their mandibles and stingers are just the beginning of their terrifying capabilities. They are masters of chemical warfare, utilizing pheromones to communicate, coordinate and overwhelm their prey. These chemical signals are their secret language, a code that orchestrates their every move with precision. Imagine a cloud of invisible terror, an odorless gas that spells doom for any insect unfortunate enough to be caught within its grasp. This unseen force is a silent killer spreading panic and confusion among their victims. These pheromones, released from specialized glands, serve as a rallying cry, summoning reinforcements from the depths of the ant colony. It's a call to arms that cannot be ignored, compelling every ant to join the fray. The air grows thick with the scent of impending doom, as hundreds, even thousands of ants converge on the location, their tiny bodies a relentless tide of destruction. Each ant knows its role, moving with a purpose that seems almost mechanical in its efficiency. This chemical assault is as terrifying as it is effective, turning the tide of battle in favor of the ants and ensuring the swift and brutal demise of their quarry. The victim stands no chance against this coordinated onslaught, as the ants' numbers and strategy overwhelm any defense. Once the prey is subdued, the ants work together to transport their prize back to the colony. This collective effort showcases their incredible teamwork and the efficiency of their chemical communication. The spoils of their conquest are shared among the colony, fueling the next generation of these relentless warriors. 
Section 5, Overwhelmed and Devoured. The final moments of an insect caught in the clutches of ants are a gruesome spectacle. The scene unfolds with a chilling inevitability as the victim struggles in vain against the relentless tide of attackers. Overwhelmed by sheer numbers, paralyzed by venom, and dismembered by razor-sharp mandibles, the prey stands no chance. The ants coordinate their attack with military precision, each one playing a role in the takedown. Some ants inject venom to immobilize the prey, while others use their powerful mandibles to tear it apart. Imagine the sickening crunch of chitin as the ants tear their victim limb from limb, their tiny bodies a writhing mass of hunger and aggression. The sound is a haunting reminder of the brutality of nature, where survival often means the complete annihilation of another creature. The ants' mandibles work tirelessly, breaking down the insect's body into manageable pieces, they work with chilling efficiency, stripping the carcass bare, leaving behind nothing but scattered fragments of what was once a living creature. Every part of the prey is utilized, ensuring that nothing goes to waste. The ants' teamwork and determination are both awe-inspiring and terrifying. The ants, their hunger sated, disappear back into the undergrowth, leaving behind a scene of carnage and a lingering sense of dread. The aftermath is a stark reminder of the harsh realities of the natural world, where life and death are in constant balance. The once vibrant insect is now reduced to mere remnants, a testament to the ant's veracity. This is the brutal reality of the insect world, a world where survival is a constant struggle and death comes in the form of a million tiny jaws. Each day is a battle for existence, and the ant's relentless pursuit of sustenance is a powerful example of nature's unforgiving cycle. The insect world is a microcosm of the larger natural order where every creature plays a role in the intricate web of life. Section 6. The Grasshopper's Nightmare. Consider the plight of a grasshopper, blissfully unaware of the danger lurking below as it leaps from blade to blade. It lands unsuspecting on what appears to be solid ground, but the ground moves. Hundreds of tiny jaws clamp onto its legs, its body panic sets in. The grasshopper kicks and thrashes attempting to escape the relentless assault. But it's no use. The ants, their numbers growing by the second, drag the hapless creature down into the darkness of their nest. The grasshopper's struggles become weaker, its movements slowing as the ant's venom takes effect. It disappears into the earth, its death throes echoing faintly from the depths, a chilling reminder of the ant's ruthless efficiency. Section 7. The Caterpillar's Doom. Even the slow-moving caterpillar protected by its soft, fleshy exterior is not immune to the ant's relentless hunger. Imagine the horror of a caterpillar inching along a branch, only to find its path blocked by a seemingly endless stream of ants. They swarm over its body, their tiny mandibles tearing through its soft flesh, their venom turning its insides to liquid. The caterpillar writhes in agony, its once vibrant colors fading to a dull gray as the life is slowly drained from its body. Its soft underbelly, normally hidden from view, becomes a gruesome feast for the ants, a testament to the brutal efficiency of nature's tiny assassins. Section 8. Spiders beware, no web can hold them. Even spiders, masters of their own domains, weavers of intricate traps, are not safe from the ant's relentless advance. Imagine a spider, perched confidently in the center of its web, sensing the vibrations of an approaching meal. But this is no ordinary prey. As the spider moves to investigate, it encounters a column of ants, their tiny bodies forming a living bridge across the silken threads of its web. The spider, its eight eyes wide with terror, attempts to flee, but it is too late. The ants, their numbers overwhelming, engulf the spider, their mandibles tearing through its defenses, their venom ending its reign as the apex predator of its minuscule domain. Section 9. Even Scorpions Fall. Scorpions armed with venomous stingers and formidable pincers might seem like an unlikely target for ant predation, but even these armored giants are not invincible. Imagine a scorpion caught off guard, its deadly stinger rendered useless against the overwhelming onslaught of an ant swarm. The ants, fearless in the face of danger, attack the scorpion's soft underbelly, their mandibles like needles piercing its armor. The scorpion thrashes, its powerful pincers snapping, but it's a losing battle. The ants, their numbers growing by the second, overwhelm the scorpion, their venom slowly paralyzing its body. The scorpion, once a symbol of deadly power, becomes just another meal for the insatiable ant colony. Section 10. A World Ruled by Fear. The world of insects is a world ruled by fear, where every rustle of leaves, every vibration in the air could herald the arrival of the ant swarm. Imagine a world where even the slightest scent of an ant sends chills down your exoskeleton, a world where safety is an illusion, quickly shattered by the relentless march of millions of tiny jaws. This is the legacy of the ants, the terror they inflict upon their prey, 
a primal fear deeply ingrained in the collective consciousness of the insect world. Their reign is one of unwavering dominance, a constant reminder that even in the smallest of creatures, nature's capacity for brutality knows no bounds. Section 11, The Reign of Ants. The next time you encounter an ant, take a moment to consider the terrifying power it represents. Beneath that unassuming exterior lies a ruthless predator, a master of strategy and violence, capable of inflicting unimaginable horror upon its prey. The ants may be small, but they are not to be underestimated. They are the true rulers of the undergrowth, their reign built on fear, enforced by the cold, calculating efficiency of the swarm. Remember the terror, remember the ants, for they are a stark reminder that even in the smallest corners of our world danger lurks, and survival is a constant bloody struggle. 